Welcome back. Let's remind you you can find our top stories on channelstv.com. Now imagine having an opportunity to acquire knowledge and equip yourself for leadership. Well, that's the story of 48 young Nigerians who have now been awarded a one-year fully funded Shevning scholarship to study in the United Kingdom. Upon their return, they are expected to contribute to the growth and development of Nigeria with the skills they will get through the experience and also join other Shevning scholars across the globe. But ahead of their journey, the awardees were treated to an award presentation ceremony at the residence of the D Deputy British High Commissioner in Ikoi, where they were advised to maximize this opportunity. It's a dream come true for successful applicants of the 2017-2018 Chevening Scholarship and an all too familiar feeling for members of the Alumni Association. Out of a total of 6,043 applications nationwide, 43 people were chosen for the scholarship, representing 0.07%. Having made it through a highly competitive screening process, they will be going to the UK to study courses of their choice for one year and join an international network of 48,000 Chevening scholars around the globe. Here at the residence of the Deputy British High Commissioner, they are celebrated by the British High Commission, partners of the program, and Chevening alumni. Congratulations. I know you will be the best ambassadors that we can imagine for Nigeria in the UK, and ambassadors for the UK to Nigeria upon your return. Chevening Scholarship, a UK government international award scholarship aimed at developing exceptional global leaders is funded by the Foreign and Commonwealth Office, including partner organizations who are proud supporters of the program. I'd like to encourage other people to, you know, work hard. We're very proud of this and we want this to continue. The unique and prestigious opportunity for aspiring leaders is one the new Chevening Fellows realize will serve as a springboard for their career. It's an opportunity for me to, to learn to network, to really, really, really gain insight. Nigeria awaits our return. Nigeria needs us. And as we live with this consciousness, we will not fail. For the Chevening Alumni Association of Nigeria, headed by the chairman, CEO of Channels Media Group, Mr. John Momo, beyond the honor and privilege of receiving a Chevening scholarship, the ultimate goal is to return and make impact in the country. I wish you Godspeed as you proceed abroad. Hearty congratulations, and we look forward to welcoming you back. We look forward to having you in our association. As the journey to academic and professional advancement begins, the message instilled in them is that Nigeria awaits their return to fill the spaces only them can fill. And from the Chevening Scholarship Award, we go to aviation in Nigeria. Airline operators and passengers at the Namdi Azikiwe International Airport have been assured of their safety in case of an emergency. The airport's emergency rescue unit is carrying out an air crash simulation exercise to test the readiness of its response team. The exercise, which was organized by the Federal Airports Authority of Nigeria, is aimed at examining the level of preparedness of all response agencies at the airport. We organized this airport emergency exercise as part of the requirements of the uh, Nigerian Civil Aviation Authority Act that stipulates that an airport, uh, an airdrome operator must test is airdrome uh, emergency plan every two years and that is to ascertain our capabilities when the real accident occur. So it is in this light that Namdi Azuku International Airport, Abuja, organizes this exercise to sensitize and uh, mobilize all our operators to see to how we could at, at, attempt to fight an accident in, a, in, a, in a Abuja airport. And that's news across Nigeria today. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Anne Wangwadu.